Welcome everyone, it's Sherry Carroll for SimonSaysStamp.com and I'm here to reveal the Whimsy Stamps Stamp Timber 2021 exclusive and this one is just so adorable. This is called Just Chicken In, like you're just checking in on your friends, you're just chicken in on your peeps. So it features several of these adorable chickens. You have some adult ones and also some little chicks at the bottom. And there's plenty of punny messages to put together for your cards and send to a friend. I'm going to be making a mini slimline note card and I'm using the mini slimline masks. And these are perfect if you want to do some coloring in with a border around the outside. So I've cut my paper down and I've already taped it to the back of the mask. And I'm going to add some clouds using the Build a Rainbow stencil. Both of these stencils are from Simon's Stamp, and I'm going to show you how to do double stenciling. So I'm going to keep that mask in place. I'm going to cover up some of these areas inside the Build a Rainbow so that I don't accidentally color them in. The colors that I'm going to be using for my clouds are the new Simon Says Stamp Positively Saturated Ink in Seafoam and also Surf. And I'll be using the Simon Says Stamp Blending Brush. I won't be changing my brush out since the colors will go well together, so I'll just use one brush for both. So I'm going to tap off a little bit once I get this going. I want my lightest colors at the top and graduating in darker tones towards the bottom. To make really nice clouds, you want to concentrate your color right at the edge of the stencil and then blend it out. And the stencil is 9 inches long, so I have plenty of clouds to work with. I'll shift everything either side to side and I'm working my way down, just readjusting so that none of the clouds look the same on my panel. Next, I'm blending Limealicious and Perfection onto my panel of cardstock, and I'm using the Snowbake die to cut out some hills. So once I have that die cut, I can slide it under the stencil, and now I'm just marking it with a pencil, and then I can trim this down so that it fits right into the masked area. I like to work this way because it keeps everything in line using those edges. I'll do the same thing for my second hill, and once I have it where I want it, I can mark it again and trim it down. For this hill, I'm going to use a little bit of dimensional foam, and I can place it right at that bottom edge of the mask for my alignment. Once I'm done with all my stenciling and coloring and hill making, I can remove my panel from the mask, and this is my entire card front background. Next, I'll be creating a sun. It's hard to see with the white on white, and I'm using the new Sunbeam ink from Simon's Stamp for my lightest color, and I'll just circle around and use the edge of the stencil and fill in, and then I can move to Citron and just work around the outer edges for a little darker color. We just came out with a matching die set that coordinates with the stencil, and I just need to use my wire trimmers to separate out the sun and a cloud. I'll be using my Misty for my stamping, and I'm stamping onto Simon Says Stamp 110 pound white cardstock, and I'm using Simon Says Stamp Intense Black Ink so I can do some Copic coloring. I like to use my sleeve to get some really good pressure and a great impression. Next, I'm stamping my message onto a white cloud, and I've just tacked that down onto the backing so that it stays in place while I do my stamping. And then I can add my second greeting separately to get them closer together. I've done my coloring for my chickens off screen, but I thought you might want to see the Copic markers that I used, and I just did basic coloring. I made my chickens gray, and then I added some white dots and a colorful tail. My grandmother used to have guineas, and I remember them being a darker gray, but having those white dots. So I thought I would kind of mock that. Then I made another little chick at the bottom using some yellows and orange. I'm returning back to my cloud and I'm just edging that a little bit with Surf ink on the left side. For dimension, I'm using some foam tape on all my chicks and chickens and also on my cloud and sun. I couldn't resist. I thought I would add googly eyes to the eyes of all the chickens and so I'm just using some Simon Says Stamp Craft Tacky Glue and gluing these eyeballs right on top of the stamped image. And now my front panel is complete, and all I need to do is adhere this to a mini slimline note card. I added a couple sequins to my son, and here's my finished card. I think it's adorable, and it just says, hanging with my peeps. I hope you've enjoyed this card using the exclusive Stamp Temper 2021 by Whimsy Stamps called Just Chicken In. 
Remember, these are limited edition and are only available while supplies last. Thanks so much for joining me, and I'll catch you next time.